Minnesota Fighting Vikings got some good news on Tuesday morning, as it appears that wide receiver coach Keenan McCardle, beloved by the players, uh, fantastic at his craft, uh, will be remaining with the team as position coach in 2023. Uh, Adam Schefter, ESPN, go. Bama OC, QR best coach Bill O'Brien. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, has returned to New England and is named the Patriots offensive coordinator. Sources tell Clow, ESPN, and me. Uh, O'Brien was Patriots assistant coach. Blah, 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 blah. Now, it's notable because Keenan McCardle was in the mix. They requested uh, permission to interview him. Uh, interview went down uh, last week, and eventually, you know, the job did go to Bill O'Brien. He was probably the prohibitive favorite. It is what it is. Uh, but I think that it's good experience for McCardle uh, as he looks to move up in his career. Uh, but uh, obviously, rooting for him to move up. Uh, if he wants to become OC, I hope he gets that. If he wants to be a head coach, I hope he gets that. Uh, but also, he is selfishly done really good things with the Vikings wide receiver room. And there's a reason why uh, when he was brought aboard uh, in 2021, the final year of Mike Zimmer staff, uh, there's a reason why uh, he was he remained. He was the only position coach that remained and crossed over from the Zimmer to the O'Connell regime just because of the reverence uh, that McArdle has from his players as well as his reputation for being just a fantastic wide receivers coach. So uh, I think that now, like I said, if he wants to keep moving on up, uh, I, I would love to see it. And say, uh, so the Ravens are uh, re requested to interview Vikings tight ends coach, passing game coordinator Brian Angelicchio. So if he gets that Ravens OC job, uh, I would say adding passing game coordinator to McArdle's uh, resume, I think that would make some sense. Because uh, what has been great about Kevin O'Connell is that he wants his assistants to move up. He wants to see, see position coaches move to coordinators. He wants to see coordinators become head coaches, etc. Uh, because he's just paying for because that's how things operate with him in his career. So uh, I love McArdle. Uh, he clearly has a great rapport with Justin Jefferson. I think they have a good working relationship as well as the rest of the receiver room that they uh, revere and adore McArdle. So, I mean, obviously... It is selfish to want to keep him uh, at a lower position uh, if, you have, if he has aspirations to move up. Uh, but I think that he will have an opportunity very soon to become an OC and potentially a head coach someday if that's what he wants to, uh, wants to do. But uh, really happy to uh, keep McArdle uh, in the building for another year, uh, working with Jefferson as he can use to grow. KJ, wide receivers, TBD. And just it'll be really good. Also, remember, he was the guy who's pounding on the table for Jalen Naylor because, uh, well, I, I do think that Naylor has a ton of potential, especially as a six round pick. Plus, Naylor uh, grew up, went to high school in uh, Las Vegas. Uh, uh, McCardle went to college at UNLV, so he got the connection there. So I think that some, I think some good things are going to be coming from the Vikings wide receiver room very soon. But uh, your thoughts are thoughts. Uh, Vikings uh, wide receiver coach Keenan McCardle is going to remain uh, for another season. Let us know your thoughts and our thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Want to support the work? Put a little something in the Venmo. But to next time, Skull Production Value.